Hey friends, this is the Miss Wolfie from our Half Acre Homestead, and today we're going to dehydrate onions. Now I got this 10 pound bag at the farmer's market for $3, and I'm just using my uh, Vidalia Chop Wizard to dice them up, and when I have them all diced up, we're going to blanch them. Alright, so when I get these all diced up, we'll be back. Okay, here we have our stock pot full of boil, well, it's not full, it's half full of boiling water. And here is our 10 pounds of onions that have been peeled and chopped. So I'm going to say it's now about 9 pounds. And we are just going to drop these in the boiling water because onions are kind of like peppers, folks, in the sense that they have a really thin skin in between the layers of the onions and you kind of want to shrink that because if you don't the onion pores will not be exposed enough and the you can dehydrate the onions raw but it'll take three times as long as it does if you blanch them so we're going to leave this and bring this up to a boil and as soon as it comes up to a boil we're going to drain and we're going to put it on our dehydrator all right we'll be back when okay we're here's our blanched onions and they're still steaming I'm not going to bother rinsing them to cool them down because they're just going on the dehydrator anyway. All right, so let's get on that. I'm using a regular dehydrator tray and I'm also using the mesh because once these onions start to dry out, they get really, really small. They become like flaked onion. Okay, so when I have these trays all filled up, I'm going to set the dehydrator for at 135 degrees or 115 depending on how long you want it to take but I'll tell you folks it goes a lot faster when your onions have been blanched it really does and if you dehydrate onions that are raw they're very much more pungent throughout your household and can make your eyes water so blanching them also helps to keep the odor down in your house when you're dehydrating. Uh, whoops, here's our seven trays on the dehydrator. Excuse me, I moved too quick. And it's set at 135 degrees. We'll come back when they're done. Okay, let's have a look at our onions. They've been in here about uh, 20 hours. And trust me folks, the first time I did onions without blanching them, it took three days. I'm not kidding. But look at these. Aren't these wonderful? Let's, let's get them in the jar. Okay, here's our jar. And I am just going to tip my trays onto a piece of parchment. And then we're just going to take and drop them in there. And when I have all my dehydrated onions bottled up, we'll be back. There you go, folks. As you can see, I had to use a much bigger jar. And that is how you get 10 pounds of onions into a half-gallon mason jar. This is the Miss Volvi from our Half Acre Homestead saying, if you don't have a lot of pantry space, dehydrate a lot of things that you use every day. Take care. Bye-bye.